Ellen Tallur is one of the most important young Indian artists who is making global waves. His works have been exhibited uh, in many major museums around the world. He was born in a small village called Kundapur in Karnataka and divides his time between uh, Kundapur and South Korea. He studied museology in MS University Baroda and his works are heavily influenced by museology and by mythologies. Actually, he traverses the mythologies of the world with the ease of the wind. This work, Ukai, is inspired by a Japanese and Chinese fishing technique called Ukai. In this technique, cormoran birds are used for catching fish. There's a noose which is tied around the neck of the bird and the birds are let loose in the water. They catch fish but cannot swallow it because of the noose around the neck and the fisherman squeezes out the fish from the neck. We have many other examples of how one animal is used for the exploitation of the other animal. In the museums, uh, when they need to clean the cadavers of uh, animals and birds, they subject these cadavers to beetles. The beetles eat up the flesh and clean up the skeleton. The Lourdes work is a commentary on the exploitation of the animals, it's also a commentary about human greed where animals are exploited for money.